unspeakable homicide of young girls in that college town in Illinois. All the victims were cut open from the throat to the crotch. Ripped right open. During the autopsy, a second stomach was found inside the first victim's body. Of course, she didn't naturally grow a second stomach. One of the stomachs belonged to someone else. As more victims piled up, there was one with two hearts, one with two livers, four lungs. Different organs each time. Of course, those extra organs didn't do the girls much good, right, Zach? And they say too much is never enough. In the end, we arrested a professor at the med school. They found the body of his daughter dead and the missing organs at his house. Do you remember what he said when we took him in? I was ordered to restore those deformed bodies back to norm. And remember who he said ordered him? An alien. Well, of course, we couldn't arrest an alien, so we arrested the professor instead. Serial killers can't be caught by logic and common sense. I learned this the hard way. That first case taught me that. Since then, these cases just keep getting more and more complicated. It's a tough job. I thought getting experience while I was young would make the job easier. Zach, is there something here that you want to check out? According to Lily, the twins should be with Kaysen. Perhaps we should try going to where she told us they might be. Hey, Sigourney. I'm glad you're here. My pot, it's getting cold. Please, let's get going. Yes, okay. I need to get to know the pot better first. That's right, now hurry up. My pot is getting cold. Zack, this is all for getting to know the pot better. Now, get the car going! My house is over by the lake. Three, two, one, go! You see, my pot is getting cold! Oh, thanks to you, my pot is still warm. I did my best. So, does the pot have anything to say? Why don't you ask yourself? Well, do you hear it? No, I don't. I'm surprised. You're a lot more hard-headed than I thought. I used to be a teacher, you know. That's when I realized the truth of the pot. Standing at the front of the class and looking at all those students, it's like looking into a pot full of different ingredients. A pot in a classroom? I don't get it. In fact, I think I'm getting farther away from understanding. Well... That's a shame, but don't give up. You're a person that can taste the different ingredients. Listen carefully. The best stew is one with plenty of different ingredients in it. Oh my! My pot is getting cold again! Did you have to talk so long?
<clears throat> you know, this doesn't taste good today. That's not true. Guys, Thomas made us a fine lunch as always. We should at least try to enjoy it. You're right. We, we shouldn't be moping around, even more so in times like these. I agree with Agent Morgan. Being so stressed out about our progress will only lead to mistakes. We should enjoy lunch. That's the very least we should do. As they say, the, uh, early bird catches the worm. Sh sh sheriff George, you probably mean laugh and grow fat. <laughs> 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 yes, well, okay. Since we're all smiling again, let's get back to work. There's another really bad one around this time of year. Three years ago. Remember, Zach? Yes, that's right. That one. Multiple homicide, same M.O. across Utah, Colorado, and Missouri. The victims were all average married housewives. But after being run over so many times by a car, they didn't look human. Five victims in two months in the three states. The way he killed them was always the same. But aside from that, there was nothing that linked the victims together. Well, they, they were all married. Age, race, nothing else matched up. Tire marks and fragments of paint ID'd the car that was used. That's where things got really tricky. The perpetrator used a 1993 model Cadillac Elante as a weapon. It was registered in the name of one senator... No, I don't feel like talking about this anymore. That senator's basement. I wish I could forget what I saw there. Two people have been murdered in our town. And now two young children are at the center of it all. I just can't come to grips with it yet. Crime will happen wherever there are people. And that's why we have our jobs. It might be easier for you because you don't live here. These were people that I knew that were killed. And the murderer might be someone who lives here in this town. It's really depressing. I know. But someone has to bring this murder to justice. You're right. I know. New York. Sometimes I just think I'm not really cut out to be a cop. Not true, Emily. You have the potential to be a superb law enforcer. You can be emotional at times, but you also possess what's most important. I do? What do you mean? What do you think? A sense of justice. Justice? <laughs> I must admit, I I'm surprised to hear such a... How should I say this? Such an obvious answer. I thought you'd say something else. Obvious or not, I joined the FBI in order to do what's right. And that's what's important. I understand, but still, you seem... Ugh, I'm sorry. I, I need some time to think. Whatever do you want to think about.
Justice. I want to think about justice. Zach, like she's quite the philosopher, isn't she? Then again, death makes everyone a philosopher. Oh. Zach, we're here. Let's continue our chat later. According to Lily, Isaac and Isaiah should be here. Then let's go and find them. Hello again, Isaac and Isaiah. I hear you're teaching Willie to do tricks. What's your secret? It's easy. Really simple. If he does it right, we give him a treat. A cookie if he does it right. I see. You're very clever. So, tell me, you two. Could you perhaps tell me your other special secret with Becky? No, we can't. It won't be a secret if we tell. Uh, I'm not telling. We promised Becky. Now that's a problem. Because I also made a promise to Becky. I promised to catch the bad man lord. But I can't keep my promise if I don't know what the secret is. Do you see? She told us to give Diane a box. It wasn't that heavy. We took it to the art gallery and gave it to Diane. Is that all Becky gave you? Um, just when we were leaving to take the box to Diane, Becky called us back. She handed us something. It was small and round. She told us to keep it safe in our pocket and give it to Diane. And then you met Carol on your way? Yep, I took the round thing out of my pocket and we looked at it. And then she talked to us. We told her that we were on an errand for Becky. She said she'd do it for us. But we told her no, because Becky asked us, not her. We promised Becky to do it ourselves. So Becky did entrust the locket to them. And now Carol has it. Right, Kason? Huh? You were in the room when Carol took the locket back from Diane. I saw you with Diane in the art gallery that day. Well, yeah, I, 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 I was there in the room, but, but I was only chatting with Diane. Oh, then Carol burst in all angry looking. While Carol and Diane had their talk, oh, I, I just sat there like a frog. Yeah, so Carol took the locket from Diane, but that has nothing to do with me, right? Uh, yes, I believe so. But from this instant, you are now a key witness in this case. I'm afraid you can't leave town until you hear from me. What? Can you do that? This is all starting to sound a little like Alice in Wonderland. Which makes you Humpty Dumpty. Huh? huh? Isaac and Isaiah, thank you. I think I'll be able to keep my promise with Becky thanks to you two. How is Becky? Is she getting better? She'll come and help out at our store again, won't she? She'll come and play with us again, won't she? Boys, about Becky. Uh, that's right. Uh, um, Becky is almost totally better now. But I don't think she'll be able to come and see you. I was told by Becky to keep this a secret. But she's actually a goddess of the forest, just like Anna. I think she's going to be in the forest with Anna for a while. Cool! We'll keep this a secret then too. Wow! That's why Anna and Becky are such good friends. <gasps> okay, okay, Willie. You're happy too, aren't you? Zack, I hope Emily doesn't end up as a forest goddess too. <laughs>